Thank you. Nice. Three, two, one, go! What's good, people? Just closing that door. So we're into game one. And we got Uno versus the Great Gonzalez. Yo, Vex. Uno on the cloud, Great Clouds Gonzalez rocking the nest. Getting that conversion off the PK fire. Ooh. Uh, did not get the snipe on the PK Thunder, but he did make him spend the spend the limit. Just to get back to the ledge. Yeah. And we are on town and city, so Ness uh, Ness's throws are gonna get very scary near the ledge. That's for sure. But Cloud's yeah. Cloud just has all of that killing power. The low ceiling, low sides, right there. Just at like that. He's at 60. Yeah. So we know back in this <coughs> with the fresh cloud. And again with cloud there's just so much inevitability because he, you know, gets stray hit after stray hit and all of his moves have some kind of killing power. So yeah. if you let him get too much percent on you, it's just a matter of time. So you really have to take out that first stock. Yeah. Cloud is a he is a double edged sword. There is a if, uh, and that back there yeah. will take it. That's one way to clean, happen. clean. All, all he needs is a good gimp, and he can be right back in this. But it doesn't look, it doesn't look like it's going to be that easy. And he manages to get back down. Catches him with the fair. He's not letting him get any breathing room. And the forward air will get him off stage, and this can be scary, oh, but he has... Wasted yeah. Well, I guess because he charged it right there, he had to. Mm -hmm. If he just fell, he would have been fine. I mean, better to use it and get back to the stage than risk not getting it, getting back to the stage. Oh, and he dodges. Very smart. Uh-oh. The bad. back air gets him back off stage, oh, and the that's down it. smash will it. take it. Good comeback from uh, from uh, Great Gonzalez. Yeah. He's not to be underestimated. And I wish Uno, instead of just up being, I wish he actually made himself go down. Mm, the second hit of Pineapple. I think he. I don't know if I was wrong, but it looked like he was close enough to actually re grab the ledge. Yeah. But right there, he kind of just did the slowest possible option. And yeah. Got punished for it. So uh, while well, we got a moment, tell us who we got on the mic here. Oh, uh, you could call me Wes Wesley or Six W X. All right. Sorry. It's a, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Clam Hat. I I commentated some of your doubles matches. Ah, well, thanks. Yeah, it, very very good stuff. Yeah. So we're going straight to Duck Hunt here. All right. So Cloud's gonna camp the tree, charge limit. And the last time I was commentating oh, a nice. set with a Ness on Duck Hunt. It ended with a Ness killing a Toon Link with PK Thunder 2 because the dog pushed him up enough to get the hit. So there's some very, very, uh, I don't want to say janky, but yeah. janky things that can happen on Duck Hunt. Yeah, Duck Hunt is a very dynamic stage. Yep. Probably the most dynamic of all the stages. Yeah. I mean, it's it's pretty much either that or Lilat, which both of them can be kind of like a, all right, I want to just kind of roll the dice with how this set is going. Maybe it'll work out in my favor and I'll get back control. That was possibly a moment to limit side beat. Oh. And now he's got those fair strings, but the dog coming uh, coming through for Cloud, putting, pushing Ness a little bit out of the way. He's reading these jumps right now. Before. And the roll onto the ledge. Down so it's like grab. And the whiff on the limit side beam. Yeah, Uno's looking a little desperate right now. Will that do it? No. Oh, All right, good. Oh, good smart up B to Ow. the tree. Oh. And oh. the up smash. Okay. I was a little scared there. Just shoveling him up with that sword. Yeah, Biddy, Uno, Uno probably would go rob, but he and I are actually both kind of. We both decided that we're going to practice our cloud today. Just cause that's why we were doing Cloud. Yeah, Cloud's. yeah. It, uh, Cloud's a good character to have practice. Yeah. But I'm sure Uno can still win this. He's my brother. He just has to be careful. 
Greg Gonzalez is no push. Good. No, no. Air dodge onto the bush. Gave him extra oh, dash attack. Ooh, Ooh almost nice. catches him at the so ledge. Early. And now oh, Cloud's kind of just catching, playing keep away. Yeah, this is what you should be doing with this kind of stage uh, layout. Ooh, he catches it with a dare. Ooh. Almost got him with that forward, uh, forward smash. Stage. Nice. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, that's it. Just like that. Well, that's Cloud. Get hit by four smash near the ledge. Yeah. Especially on a, a Duck Hunt because I believe the side blast zones are, are uh, closer in. Especially uh, compared to other stages like Battlefield or FD yeah. or uh, Dreamland. Battlefield. Definitely Battlefield and Dreamland. I'm not quite sure. They're not as far in as like yeah. Smashville or Town and City, but those yeah. are... Yeah. Those are pretty, uh, yeah, yeah, those are the octagons of, uh, the, the that's MMA that's octagons that's of, uh, Smash that's 4. That's yeah. Oh, FD. Oh, there's the Pac-Man. Interesting. Pac-Man okay. coming out against the Ness. The Uno Pac. Oh. And that was after he took the game. Yeah. So maybe he's trying to it's, keep, uh, Jake Gonzalez off balance. It's probably because it's FD. He, true. Without true. any platforms to land or get extra pressure, it's yeah. a lot easier for Cloud to be just forced to land into something bad and then get put off stage. Ooh, the fire. PK fire activated the hydrant. Mm -hmm. so, Ooh, and that ooh. goes right through the hydrant. The hydrant to up air. So, good little combo. Good little action. Pac-Man's setups can be Pac really scary. He has so yeah. many options with that fruit yeah. and the hydrant too. I do enjoy Uno's Pac-Man because it's very creative. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh now, my that is goodness. That you need to watch out for. Reflectors will hurt Pac-Man a lot. It's a long fly ball in the left field. <laughs> yeah, and Uno was not ready to catch that. No way. That was the uh, fielding error. Yeah, he's, he's really loving these forward smashes. Right yeah, now. he's going ham with this bat. He's got the bell out now. Like oh, oh man. That's man. Another one. His batting average is, you know, pretty, pretty, pretty darn I'd, good. I'd say it's about 30%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 30 he's batting bat at average. least 300 here. Yeah. He's getting, oh no. That's and he's got to get luck. back up. Oh, cool. it just makes it. Uh. Man, he's about to get two stock right here if he doesn't shake up. This is CK Thunder sends him away, up. and again. Oh, catches it. Oh, yeah, Greg Gonzalez has his number. Right? I mean, he's got max rage now, so he's got that going for him. Ooh. Wow, he got wow. the grab. Who says Pac Man grab is bad? <laughs> I'm not saying Pac-Man's grab is bad, but I am saying that's the first time I've seen a Pac-Man get a grab and grab. Oh, there. Yeah. All right. And that just that's, like that. That's it. Well, it was a good try, but yeah. Uh, that that second stop, the momentum was completely in Gonzalez's favor. Man. Yeah, I th I think it, uh, once he got that kind of that snipe with the bat yeah. to the hydrant, that might have uh, put him on tilt slightly. Yeah. Maybe a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, without reading too much into player mindset, yeah. but it, it, uh, he didn't really have an answer. He didn't, he, he wasn't able to come back from that. Yeah. Yeah. So Gonzalez took that. Yeah. So I think that was winners. Yeah, they're both winners. Okay. So, uh, Uno still has a, uh, loser's run ahead of him. Oh, looks like I'm up. All right. Well, Good luck. Thank you. So we may have another commentator coming in. Okay, so we have two more commentators coming in. So it was a pleasure commentating for you. You can follow me at twitch.tv slash clamhat or twitter.com slash dukehoppler, H-O-P-P-L-E-R. We got two more commentators coming, for, coming up for you and some great singles action.